All right, people, welcome back. More Daily Duel. So we are joined by Slate. Hello, guys. So this is episode 944, so less than 60 to go. Daily Duels is going to wither away. <laughs> I, I, and the sad thing is I still don't know what we're going to do. <laughs> like, like I don't know what we're going to do for the big finale of Daily Duels. I'm not sure. I'm really not. So we, I still got a couple of months to think about it. And I was actually just talking to uh, Slate about you know, the possibly the upcoming channel changes. That's that's a pretty big possibility is some channel changes. What I'm thinking about doing is possibly just what similar to what we do with Daily Duels. Like, have you guys suggest some things that I could possibly do on the channel? Then maybe put them up on a poll and seeing what you guys want to see on the channel. Because I have some ideas, but I'm just not sure if that's what you guys want to see. And with Yu-Gi-Oh being so stale right now, <laughs> like hopefully that ban list comes and, you know, Everything will be great. Just upload some casual content, you know? I mean, <laughs> I'm, I'm not too much of a competitive player. I mean, my, some yeah. of my viewers... What the fuck? What the hell just happened? Is it just quit? Yeah, I guess. Oh, wow, that's... that's um, okay. <laughs> so, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, and then this hand is not as great. God damn it. That last hand was so good. <laughs> this hand's kind of... <laughs> well, let's let's so yeah so they know what you're what you're running right but let's talk about what i'm running yeah what are you running i am running battle and boxers <laughs> um i'm running with desires i'm running 44 cards i made it yesterday on a whim uh just because i had some battle and boxer cards uh you know i've always i've always like had the commons right and i was always i was always thinking you know what what's a good way to build this deck and desires just makes it seem like it could be viable it's just a rank four deck it's not it's, it's not that special but it's it's pretty good. It has some recurrence. It has some some special summon ability. They have a monster born card, which is pretty good. So it's yes. a good deck. If I can set up my pendulum scales, so you could pendulum summon. So that's not terrible. <laughs> oh, all right, cyber angels. Oh, this is going to be a difficult duel. This deck is really good. <laughs> so do, do they run herald or no? Depends. Depends. Some run herald. Some run ultimaya. Some run you know, pure. I've seen I've seen totally different variants of it. I've seen uh, star seraph thrown in. So what's a good thing to, like, what's a good Xyz monster? Do, do they use the graveyard, or? What's a good Xyz monster to go into right now? Utopia Lightning. Lightning? Okay. Because, mm -hmm. he, obviously, he's going to try to honest you. <laughs> so, Utopia Lightning is the perfect answer. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. I need to figure out what I want to do with my channel. Maybe I should talk to Cali Effect more and be like, you know, what do you think? Because, I mean, Cali Effect made his channel after me. I worked with him and he passed me up, surpassed me with ease. Everybody does. So, you know, I don't know. Maybe it's something on my end. Maybe I, sometimes I still think it's probably my YouTube name and stuff. Like, who One I, of the problems. Sorry, go ahead. I was just thinking, it's like, who, who, you know, who the fuck wants to do anything with Ubel? Ubel is trash, so, you know, then they think that I'm a <laughs> trash you, you, uh, you YouTuber. One of the problems with this deck is that there's not really, like, a good first turn, you know? Like, I can't go into... I, I mean, I can, but it will be... I mean, if you can if you can go into your battling box or XC monster, the... Uh, uh, yeah, I'm probably going to just end up going into him, because, um... I can't... If I use Spar, I can't conduct my battle phase, so... Oh, okay. That was one of them. I was like, I was like, one, isn't it like you cannot, like, special summon monsters outside of battling boxers? You can't conduct your Yeah, that, that's something. that's a different one. That's Switch Hitter. That one's the uh, the Wolf Bark of the deck. But also, like, the best one is, is Shadow, but the problem with Shadow is that I need to have an Xyz monster face up already. I have Shadow in my hand right now, so Shadow goes good with uh, with, Le with Lead Yoke, so I'm going to go for Lead Yoke. Yeah. Uh, but I can't conduct my battle phase, so... I said, you, should, we sh you should be okay for right now. It's, it's going to switch to his partner unless he has an honest... I don't think the problem with not conducting your battle phase and not handling that Manju is that he could just summon a level 4 make a cast down and handle you, so. Yeah. <laughs> or we could just play Blue Eyes Deck Deck and I fucking called that. Did I not? Did I, you, you, you're sitting you were hitting there, we were talking. Did I not call that shit? Mm hmm. You know, should I play Mind Control? No, those people are probably just gonna play Blue Eyes Got Deck. What the fuck are you gonna do with their 8s? <laughs> Blue Eyes Got Deck. Like, yep. Uh, tough, so he's tough. gonna attack you and then you're gonna get as strong as him? Like, okay, sure. <laughs> it's not like he can use his effect during the main phase. You can't attack if you use your effect, right? Or vice versa? Who? Uh, Blue Eyes Alternative? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So, just a 3,000 beater, so. 
Now what? <laughs> and he'll be 38 during my turn because I'm going to use Shadow to hit past the other material. Oh, I got Solemn Strike. Ew. <laughs> Fucking one day. Son of a bitch. How come you get to draw the card and I can't do any damage? Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Tackles. Tackle props. Yeah. Alright, so I need to play text damage, but I can still kill your monsters. Yeah, I mean, you know, Maiden is Maiden, so Maiden will do Maiden things. Yeah. I'm thinking about... I'm thinking about Pendulum summoning a monster to attack over the Thousand of the Manju, and then crashing with the alternative to kill him before he kills us with his effect next turn. And then going up to 38 with your lead yoke, or lead yoke, or whatever his name is. It's it's probably lead. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I, I thought that maybe the stuff on his head is supposed to be lead, so maybe that's lead yoke, but I say lead yoke. Mm -hmm. So, I'll go ahead and set out my Pendulum scales, make sure I'm not to activate my cannon in main phase 2, because that'd be terrible. <laughs> Hmm. I, th I think it's at the end phase, yeah, it's at the end phase. Start my end phase, pop a face up, spell a trap. Like, oh yeah, let me go ahead and pop my own pendulum scale. <laughs> is normal pendulum like relevant, like ever? No. Okay. So right. what's the what's the what's the like? What are the like the positives that the deck has? I mean, it's the pendulum mechanic. That's that's the number one positive. So you already know. Does it do the pendulum mechanic well? Yeah, yeah. I, I'd say their scales are decently, uh, decently broad, strong. Uh, that their pendulum effects, their pendulum effects are actually pretty decent if you're playing like normal monsters. But um, but the problem with them is, is that they don't have any field effects. You know, so because they yeah. don't have any field effects, they're just kind of there. I mean, yeah, that's 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 what a normal monster is. So. <laughs> yeah. All right, so we're up to thirty-eight. Oh, that was nice. You crashed and then got up to thirty-eight. That was good. I could yeah, activate it. I could activate it. No, 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 not Kenny. <laughs> Calm down, Kenny. Awesome. We have MST, Twin Twister, and Strike. Now all we need is Warning. <laughs> Dude, imagine going up against six Solemn Strikes. <laughs> that was just shit. <laughs> there was one guy who I dueled who was like actually one of my viewers and subscribers, and he's like, oh my god, you're the room you last year. I'm just, you know, I'm such a big fan. And I was like, oh, cool, you know, it's one of my fans. And then he ended up playing a fucking deck of just pure mirror forces, and I never got to into a suit. Dude, that's cool. I like that. I was like, oh my god, like every <laughs> mirror force imaginable. That's funny. No, mm. I don't know. I mean, it's not that good because, you know, I'll, eventually you'll realize it and you'll just destroy the back row before you attack, but like, it's it's funny. <laughs> I, that's something that I would do. And I was like, where are my twin twisters? <laughs> like he hit me with every mirror force under the fucking <laughs> fucking sky. I was like, god damn. <laughs> All right, so you're gonna tribute Ben Ten, summon Ben Ten. Ben Ten is the searcher one, right? Yeah, searcher another one. You already conducted normal summon though. So, so there's a uh, there's mirror force. There's dark mirror force. There's drowning mirror force. There's storming mirror force. Blazing mirror force and quaking mirror force. And then there's radiant mirror force. Right? Those are all of them. And Mirror Force Dragon. <laughs> I'm sorry, I was I was thinking he was gonna know. I think he was playing um uh Romages or Morphe or Romages or Romages. Uh well rip to your monster. Yeah, why'd you strike the <laughs> did you strike the cyber petite angel? Yeah. Oh yeah, you strike the cyber petite <laughs> you, angel. Why didn't you strike the honest? <laughs> no. No, because I don't want him to get search. Dude, there's like no, but there's like no ways to get over honest <laughs> except no. for a strike. No. <laughs> Fuck it. Monsters are expendable. Searching and resources are forever. Yeah. Like diamonds. Diamonds are forever. <laughs> diamonds are girls' best. <laughs> what the fuck am I on? <laughs> uh, I'm not well, sure I mean, if we're going to get much use out of these Twin Twisters and MSTs. I think they were hell dead draws. I really wanted Shadow. I guess we have enough back row. Well, I, I really wanted Shadow. I, you know, uh, to tell, you know, to tell the truth, I'm not gonna lie. I forgot that he had honest. I completely forgot. I just saw the cyber petite angel. And I was like, "Fuck that!" I'm not gonna allow you to serve. Yeah, like I definitely would have saved the strike for the for the honest. Um, all right, so what do we got right now? But striking that cyber petite angel definitely stopped his plays because he could have he could have fucked this up a lot harder than he did. Because even he could have searched for the machine angel that he really wanted to get, then he could have attributed both the Ben Tens, got double search off the Ben Tens, summoned a much stronger cyber angel than just Ben Ten. So, in the end, I, th I, th I think the play was fine. It's just you lost your monster. So sorry about that. <laughs> and you can kill uh, Button. Oh, well, I guess you could kill Maiden twice. You didn't. You didn't have anything to pendulum summon. You know you could pendulum summon, right? Oh yeah, I could have. <laughs> uh, I kind of say get rid of Maiden. 
I'd say attack Maiden twice. I'm not really worried about Ben 10. She ain't doing shit. Okay. She's only an 18 tech monster, unless she gets fucking tributed with the Blue Eyes player. Right? Yeah, I could have Pendulum. So, oh, uh, I'll save Maxi. No, she's not summoning. This is the other guy, dude, unless he's doing Blue Eyes in his deck. So he, she's oh, just okay. going to defense mode, so just attack her again and she'll die. Yeah, it's from Graveyard. You can summon that? Yeah, it's treated as a normal monster. I mean, uh, it's treated as Blue Eyes White Dragon in the graveyard. I did not know it was treated as Blue Eyes White Dragon in the graveyard. Oh, my God. That's annoying. Fucking Blue Eyes. I thought it was true. Oh, wow. All right. All right. If I'd known that was, I would have done different. I would have done different plays. Fucking hindsight. That's what I was curious about, because I was going to avoid attacking it altogether, but then I, I, you were like, I, oh. I was like, there was like, there's no blue eyes. Like, what are you talking about? Wow. All right. Yeah. And then he could block was... it with fucking Machine Angel Ritual. All right. This duel's going down. Here. I guess I can cast it into the other guy's deck. <laughs> yeah, I guess. Wait, who's to say you want to summon another blue eyes? Like, that fucking sucks. I was like, I was like, there's no blue eyes. Like, oh yeah, this counts. Like, why can you summon this thing? Like, it should only be special summoned from its own effect. Why do you get to summon it all improperly after it's summoned? Like, it's so dumb. Because uh, it's fucking Kaiba shit. That's why. Like, it's fucking Kaiba shit. What's Castell's defense? 2,000? No, 15. Like, oh, that's annoying. <laughs> I was totally thinking that, no, there's no more blue eyes, so just go ahead and handle her. She'll be done. I mean, he blocked it's it anyway. It's going into the other guy's deck, though, because he can't summon it. Like, if he draws it, it's dead. I mean, he could tribute it for his ritual place. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> <laughs> I said, I'm not sure if we're going to get much use out of these MSTs and Twin Twisters. Blue eyes guy still has an ass ton of resources. That field Dropping spell, I guess. Does he play it? Uh, do people play it? I don't know. I, I thought it was pretty good. I don't think people play it. Okay, because uh, but people, I, don't, I, don't, I don't, video. don't even play Chaos Max anymore. So. Yeah, well, that was kind of like I think that is kind of its own little thing. Like, I, first of all, Chaos Max is great, but I don't really think the Blue Eyes deck is is kind of like revolving around like a Ritual Summon. Mm. Like, I think it's better with Frank Eights and stuff. Yeah, and then uh, level nine and level nine synchros, of course. Yeah, Spirit though, no. the card's so good. <laughs> Would you ever run level leader in blue eyes to make Trish? <laughs> they don't do that. I don't know. You know. One crazy thing that they fucking do is they throw in uh, Seraphonite for the additional normal summon. So once they go into Spirit and attribute it off for like uh, Moonlight, and then they'll summon a level one tuner and then go into Crystal Wing. <laughs> Dude, you love Crystal Wing. <laughs> I, I, I'm just saying, that's what people do. People love them yeah, some Crystal nah, Wing. It's not worth it. Crystal Wing's overrated. Like, at face value, all it is is negate a monster effect. Like, the other thing doesn't really matter. Like, the gain attack or whatever it is. I'm thinking about <laughs> striking Maiden. I mean, dude, we have two, so. Yeah. <laughs> we have two and 9,900 life points, so. <laughs> yeah, because Maiden's going to get annoying. I don't even think they really play Maiden anymore. I mean, dude, the, the thing is, there's so many good cards in that deck that you can, like, kind of have some diversity with the build, you know? It's not like PK Fire, where it's pretty, like, the, it's pretty much the same in every deck. Well, thanks thanks for returning your monster from attack to defense position so you take more damage, because my normal monsters have pierce damage. Piercing, hey! Yeah. <laughs> Shouts out to Lance of Fornicus! <laughs> <laughs> my monster's in defense, so it's like taking it. <laughs> ah, but you still take the piercing damage! Fucking man, Yu-Gi-Oh! animes, I swear to Christ, they gotta explain everything. <laughs> <laughs> uh, do I have like a rank 5 play? I think, I think I run both the source and Gaia Charger and stuff like that. Yeah, I do, so. Ah, shit, I love Yu-Gi-Oh! <laughs> We're beating fucking Cyber Angels and Blue, Blue Eyes, Eyes with normal Pendulum and Battle and Boxers. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Oh, this is great. Is and it... we have all this, dude, the strikes are just doing well. Alright, alright, so are we striking this? I'm striking it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he's like, they're like, what the fuck? Like, yeah, I have Max E for the Blue Eyes guy, so. Yeah, not my fault, fucking Konami. You'd like to strike at three, and then we can each run three strikes. There's nine, I mean, six strikes, nine. Terrible. Are you running Morning too? Yeah. So we got fucking eight solemns. <laughs> yeah. Fuck life points. And, 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 I mean, we're at the perfect amount of life points right now. <laughs> what are you, 12? <laughs>
Oh, man. See, life points don't mean shit. It's all about resources, and clearly we have the resources because we keep hitting you with shit, and the blue-eyes guy ain't doing shit. Hell yeah, foolish. <laughs> and I got the pendulum mechanic on my side. I could just keep pendulum summoning my monsters. Attack, pendulum summon, attack, pendulum summon, attack, pendulum summon. So I can get any of these dudes back. Uh... I mean, are you going to do anything right now, or are you just going to hold on to your resources? Uh, I was going to, I guess, yeah, because the, because having, uh, it can't be destroyed by battle, but, or once per turn it can't be destroyed by battle, so I don't know, I guess I'll just hold it. Okay. But, you won't, I mean, what are you going to do with your standing effect? You already used Glass Draw this turn, are you going to get that effect once per turn? Uh, uh, the, the honest guy, uh, what's his counter punch? Oh, don't you already have a counter punch? Is it once per turn? I'm not sure. <laughs> Counterpunch. During the ambush step, yeah. blah, blah, blah. Yeah, it's once per turn. Okay. It's hard once per turn. I mean, it's still good to have him in there. Mm -hmm. But yeah, you're right. It would be better to just use Glass Jaw so I can actually make an XE summon play next turn. Yeah, the Glass Jaw is not once per turn. Uh, Glass Jaw is not once per turn, right? No. You just can't add, except for. Uh, yeah, you can't add Glass Jaw with Glass Jaw, but. Okay. Yeah, he's no turn. Good to know. Good to know. I, st I don't know. I don't know if I would have waited or not. Mm. Alright, the left guy. You got six cards in your hand. Like, I'm expecting fucking at least another alternative. I have I have a max C, so hopefully he doesn't reveal alternative and actually does like a play that I can respond to. Oh, like that. he actually does play. <laughs> ah, shit. Oh, shit. I had ah, ignore. Shit. I had ignore chain on. I'm an idiot. Wow. <laughs> I'm doing it. Ah, uh, not worth it. No, 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 it's not worth it. Ah, kill me. What does that do? Oh, You're that can do it now. <laughs> yeah, you can do it now. Wow, alright. Oh, this duel got a lot fucking harder. Yeah. Uh, how am I supposed to handle mm. this? And, and, and I can't even, like, put my monsters in defense and stall with fucking facing down Chaos Max. Like, fucking Chaos Max. I hate this card. Like, why did they make this card? <laughs> Dude, I just love... Double piercing battle damage. Like I was so hyped about that. Like <laughs> I don't. I, saw that, that. I don't care about the double piercing. I do care about that you made a fucking four thousand attack monster a fucking magic specter. I care about that. I just thought it was funny that. I don't know. I just think it's funny that it says double piercing. That's that's that's, that's just fucking disgusting. Like, are you on crack? <laughs> so I I have no idea how I'm gonna get out of this situation. God damn it. By twin twisting our own scales. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> does, does the deck run Silver's Cry? Yeah, yeah, I believe it does. Okay, because I, I like I, I've always liked that card. If only I had Ooh, another. Of, if only I had another level four monster, but I don't. What's in your hand? Twin Twister, another. Oh, twin I should have summoned. Monster. I should have summoned Headgear. Dang it. Yeah, we would have summoned Headgear. You, well, you convinced me not to, but I mean, it's, it's still my fault because I should know my deck, but... <laughs> I, I never seem to know my deck in Daily Duels. <laughs> it's fine. I just, I don't, I don't know. I think we, I think we, I really, I think we lost because... I mean, I could punch them summon everybody and then try to hold off, but... And the, and the sad thing is, even if I, I could go into, like, Volcasaurus and, like, you know, pop, try to pop his blue eyes, but he could just block the destruction, so there's really no point. Well, if, wait, but if you put Mandragon in defense, we just lose. Yeah, so I'm, I'm saying, so there's no <laughs> point in fucking putting my shit in defense mode. Yeah. So I literally have to summon an attack mode. Oh, and my shit's in your pen and skill, too. Uh, yeah, I think we lost. I think we lost fucking, fucking Chaos Max, man. Like, why? And you were just talking about how they don't play it anymore, and then it comes to... Yeah, I said, I said competitively don't play it. Some people just like playing it. And if I was playing Blue I'd play it because I get to bust out a fucking 4,000 fucking magic spectrum. Untargetable, yeah. That's... Untargetable, can't be destroyed by card effect, motherfucker. And I got broken ass gospel. Like, all right. Yeah. Fuck. Fucking gospel. Like, why'd they make that card? Uh, it's, it's good. It's it, like, like, thank Christ Dragon Rulers are banned. Like, are you on crack? Well, no, but, uh, okay, first of all, <laughs> when you said gospel at first, I didn't know what you were talking about. So, yeah, Return of the Dragon Lords, okay, just, yeah, the team was Dragon yeah. So, yeah, so, uh, I think they made it with the Dragon Rulers never coming back in mind. <laughs> like, that card's never gonna be played in Dragon Rulers, because Dragon Rulers are never gonna come back. They better not. 
I mean, I mean there, you got some people who are very, very liberal and want Dragon Rulers to come back, like Mega Capital G and stuff, so. So people that don't understand, like, the Dragon Rulers were the best deck, like, ever. Like, I, I mean, I'm not saying, like, unlimited format, but I'm saying in their own format, Dragon Rulers were the best. Like, it's bad enough that we gotta deal with Chaos Max, and we can do that. We can do that with Topia Lightning, but he has Gospel, so. Like, why? You gave Dragons a Revival card and Protect from Destruction? Like, are you on crack, Konami? Why would you give them that? Why would you give the strongest fucking type at monster in Yu-Gi-Oh that card? All right, what can I do here? Uh, I can Pendulum Summon, and I should probably play Ronga Minyad in this, just because they're all warriors. Like I said, you can go into like what? You can go into Topia Lightning, but they ain't gonna do shit. Yeah, like Utopia. So, how many? They have, they have enough life points. Uh, Unless you run like Ray in your extra deck. So, you can use Utopia Lightning's effect twice. Yeah, no, all I can. Uh, I can't. I can. I can negate the effect. So, there's this guy named ba Battle and Boxer uh, Star Cestus. Mm -hmm. it left, it's like a, sort of like a Xerophine. Mm -hmm. But. So, if you could bust him out plus another monster, then that'd be pretty good. Because then you can negate, and then, you know, you can cast him away, or you can, you know... Castellan would be great if you had another one. Or, I have Castell, yeah. Yeah, so can you bust out both of them? You can use my monster and my pendulum scale. Okay, how do I do no, that? No, wait, no, no, you can't. Because it's in my extra deck. God damn it. No, All so, I, can... I, don't think, I don't think we got a way out of this. Yeah, I'm, I'm just... I, I have one Castell in my extra deck. I have one in the Grave Room, one in my extra deck. Uh... Because you'd have to bust him out, negate the, the Chaos Max, and have a cast out. So you pretty much need four level four monsters, and I know you don't have that, so. No. If only you had my fucking knight. <laughs> uh, what does this do? Uh, I don't like blue eyes. I don't mind them, but I don't like them. Like, I'm tired of fucking stupid shit in Yu-Gi-Oh. Like, this is clearly stupid. This is clearly stupid. Like... I can make I can make I can summon four level four monsters. What would that what would that help me do? Well, you can go into your, wait. Is your stuff guy? Is he two level four monsters? Everything's gonna be four. No, he's three. God damn it. Yeah. I say if he was two, then you could just go into him, then the gate, then go into Castell, but no, he's he's three. So, oh, cause stupid Chaos Max plus stupid Gospel equals stupid. Cause we'd be able to handle Chaos Max with Topia the Lightning. Like that's the only thing that it's like. Oh, well, he's not too broken. You can just handle with Topia the Lightning, but. Yeah, you have fucking Gospel, so how the fuck do I handle that? Gospel doesn't activate in the graveyard, it just does, so... <laughs> I don't really have any... I mean, can to... you... Can you go into... What's his name? Then, like, detach Shadow, and then summon Shadow back during your main phase, attacking Symmetry from Battling Boxer, Control Special on this card? Here, I got... I, oh, I have oh my... it's from your hand. I thought it was from the graveyard, too. I'm gonna make this guy anyway, just because I... Uh, uh, this is the little... I've never actually... We were winning! Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, you got attack with it too? <laughs> okay, so that takes the damage we would have taken. Now what? <laughs> I do nothing. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're dead. We're dead. Rip. <sighs> I just wanted to see if I could make a play, but that's all I could do. <sighs> I don't yet own that card. I, I plan on building Battle and Boxers uh, with real cards, but I don't yet own that one via the Star Cestus. Mm -hmm. Dude, Melody of Awakening Dragon is one of the best cards in that deck. Mm -hmm. I mean, oh, let me just get all the materials I need to summon alternative. Yep. <laughs> like, Blue Eyes, Blue Eyes is strong. That's a potential win world, shit. <laughs> I could see that. I could easily see them winning worlds. Oh, GG, I guess. <laughs> uh, if only I would have got fucking Keating. Not that Keating would have helped in this situation.
Oh shit, did he just kill himself? Or at least close to it? If only we could have got a little bit more damage out. It's close. It's close. He didn't attack though. He what? Afraid. We have a shot. So all it's I have whenever, to do- it's, Wait it's a minute! Any battle. Oh, it's any battle in Boxer! Is it once per turn? It's not once per turn, so I could use it with Shadow. Okay, so that's that's what he did. that's what I that's what both he and I didn't realize is that uh, um, Shadow um, works with him um, too. Wait, Damn it. hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. We might win. Okay, I wouldn't <laughs> have been able to win last turn anyway because uh, three thousand over eighteen is only twelve, so I wouldn't have been able to do all the damage. But like, like your fucking your fucking Celtus thing might have just saved us. I think we. I okay. Think we might I, win. I wish. I mean, it wouldn't have mattered if I had used it had used it properly because. He wouldn't have attacked into me there, so. Like, if I would have used it with Shadow, he would have realized that it works with Shadow too, and then he would... He, it's not once per turn, though, which is really good to know. <laughs> so it works with any of the... What level are they? They're 10, so you can go into... That's... Oh, he, did, he doesn't have... He doesn't have the uh, Super Dreadnought Cannon. Wow, now you're kidding. So do we have a shot to win? Yeah. I think we won. They only have 400... Dude! Shit, I have Cowboy. I want to win with Cowboy. <laughs> oh, damn, do you have Cowboy? <laughs> uh, I might. Really? So please have Cowboy. No, I don't have Cowboy. Dang. I, I think I need to put Ranga Minyad in this. Although I guess I won't get to Pendulum Summon normally, but I can definitely make it. But I can do this, so. That's game. We win. GG. GG. That was a good game. That was a good game. That yeah, it was. was. That was difficult. <laughs> dude, I'm surprised. Dude, dude, but do you realize what just happened? We beat Cyber Angels and and Blue Eyes with normal pendulum and battling boxers. <laughs> That's awesome. Thank God you, you, your battling boxers stayed on the field and you did all that damage. Ah. Uh -huh. Ah. Uh -huh. <laughs> the mic. We're done. <laughs> that was great. That was great. <laughs> Oh my god, you're like, should I go on this guy? Oh, sure, I'm not. He doesn't fucking do anything. He won us the duel. <laughs> <laughs> because he attacked into the fucking Shadow. And Shadow lived. <laughs> like, wow. Because if Shadow would have died, no, we would have lost. It's fucking, if we would have took all that damage, no, we would have lost. Because he attacked into the Shadow, it survived. He didn't want to attack. He didn't want to do anything else. He decided to pop the fucking him with alternative. And when he left a little four in the field, so real. <laughs> Yeah, he probably thought that if he attacked into Full Cult's cannon, that you'd also take the uh, that he'd also take the damage. But it's only, I think it's only battle boxers, so yeah. yeah. Not that would have, that wouldn't have killed us though. That would have only been eight hundred. Yeah. Okay. But I mean, you still you still would have attacked, right? Yeah. So. All right, we're done. So thank you, Slate, for joining me. That was good. That was good. Yeah, it was. It was fun. I'm glad I got to show off the battle boxer deck. <laughs> so uh, be sure to subscribe to Slate. Link to his channel is in the description. Description. <laughs> <laughs> so I hope that you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Thanks for all support. I will see you guys tomorrow playing um, Dark Lords. Dark Lords. All right, people. Thanks for watching.